Hey guys, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Uh, I'm just playing a Call of Duty Strike Team on my Jason Prime. I know that this game is not available in uh, uh, Google Play Store, and I'm going to uh, link the description below of this game. And uh, you just have to uh, disable a uh, Google Play uh, to play this game because it does not support audio. So let's do this, guys. Yep. House Speaker Bosworth continues her unlikely march towards the Oval Office. With polls now leaning heavily in the Congresswoman's favor thanks to her Bridge the Gap campaign. Bosworth has stood firm with an aggressive and costly cyber defense stance and repairing relations with China through open communication and intelligence sharing. Tensions have been steadily on the rise between the two superpowers since the 2018 cyber attack on the stock market. China continues to hold the U.S. accountable for the attack and its resulting global economic meltdown, despite the president's insistence that it was an act of terrorism perpetrated by the Internet's largest fallout socio-political movement, Cordis D.A. And finally, our feature story, an in-depth look into the Cordis D.A. movement, who recently reached a social networking milestone. Known only by his online alias Odysseus, Cordis DA's mysterious figurehead has been labeled both a champion and a terrorist to foment social uprisings for personal financial gain. These stories and more on tonight's edition. the border between us and the Russian Federation. And this is Sapsite Juliet 2-Niner, a retrofitted Cold War ICBM silo, and it does not exist. Seven hours ago, the Russian nuclear icebreaker NS Baikonur lost power and drifted into U.S. waters, within spitting distance of the site in question. Radiation levels suggest a meltdown and subsequent explosion of the ship's reactor. Earth shattering? Until we receive this. These surveillance images suggest the Russians just committed an act of war against the United States. The Russians deny responsibility and state, well, state is buying it though it can't substantiate. POTUS is sanctioned to join off with our Russian counterparts as a sign of good faith. Mission prop board, re-secure the site and find out what the hell is going on. The SSN Utah's on standby to receive your team in the Barren Sea. Remember, Commander, Mission requires you keep your whole team alive. No man left behind. Overlord, this is team leader. Onslaught has entered the theater. Strike team onslaught, this is Overlord. Weather system has moved in. Mission is a go. We use the weather to cover our approach. Roger, Onslaught. Keep in touch. Out. The graphics looks amazing. Even though it's a 2013 game and uh, there's no setting for the graphics options to make it high or low. Yeah, uh, so because there is no shadow in this game, that's why it runs smoothly. Stay out of sight. Eyes on target. Silently kill the guard. Oh. Yeah, their gear is definitely Russian military issue. How do we know we're not walking into a Russian trap? Mission hasn't changed. Stay on task. Weapon toss. Use your silent 
sniper rifle to take out the guard. Move it! Okay, that went easy. Okay, I just played uh, this game already in a chase uh, LG uh, L80, uh, which was similar to this price, but it was way too lagging. Uh, there was not option like a SW and a screen resolution. You can change in this uh, device. Uh, there was no option for the LG, and there was not even a, a room custom room for the device. So. So this is good,
on you. Got what we came for. Head to the exit. 